An Australian man woke up to a pleasant but shocking surprise when he checked his bank account on Monday morning. He found himself in control of $58 million of someone else's money. Jess Davis took to Twitter on Monday to share the incredible find her boyfriend made. Watch the latest news on Channel 7 or stream for free on 7 Plus My boyfriend woke up with $58 million of someone else's money in his bank account this morning, she said. And rather than take the money and run, he opted to call the bank and tell them of the error. We could be living on our own island somewhere by now. Sad. Loading tweet Jess added that the money was not $58 million in liquid cash however, but was instead was a bunch of accounts worth $58 million that he has now got control over. Those in the comments section of the post praised the man for his incredible honesty. He's either the best boyfriend or the worst boyfriend, one user joked. What an honest bloke, good on him. But 58 million, wow. Another added. Others suggested he should get some sort of bonus for handing the money back. What the hell Jess, like everyone's saying, really deserves a cool million for his honesty here, one said. Is there a finder's fee? Surely a cheeky 1% to return it to its rightful owner wouldn't be missed? Another added. However, it's not the first time a large sum of money has accidentally been deposited in an Aussie's bank account. Crypto platform accidentally transfers $10.5 million to Melbourne women went on a spending spree earlier in the year after $10.5 million was accidentally deposited into one of their bank accounts. One of the world's largest cryptocurrency trading platforms, Crypto.com, accidentally transferred the money to thief Aminogari Manibal back in May 2021, when the company was attempting to process a refund of just $100. Instead of transferring the refund, however, someone entered an account number in the payment section and accidentally transferred the large sum. Now. The company has launched legal action against Manival and her sister Thilagavathi Gangadori, after realizing its mistake. The error was discovered during an audit in December 2021, court documents revealed, however, the only issue, the sisters had already spent a portion of the money. The court found that following the error last year, Manival transferred the $10. 1 million into a joint account. Then in February this year, the funds were taken out of two accounts to buy a $1.35 meters million property in Craigieburn. It's understood Manival had bought a five bedroom home as a gift for her sister. Now, the crypto company has won part of their legal battle with a judge in Victoria's Supreme Court ordering the luxury home be sold, and the money returned to the company. The case returns to court in October. Citibank scandal a bit further offshore and back in 2021. A judge ruled that Citibank wouldn't be allowed to recover the almost half a billion US dollars it accidentally wired to lenders in one of the biggest blunders in banking history. Citibank, which was acting as Revlon's loan agent, meant to send about 8 US dollars, $10. 35 million in interest payments to the cosmetic company's lenders. Instead, Citibank accidentally wired almost 100 times that amount including 175 US dollars, 226 Australian dollars, million to a hedge fund. In all, Citibank accidentally sent 900 US dollars, 1156 Australian dollars, million to Revlon's lenders. Citibank filed the lawsuit in August seeking the return of its funds, but it still has not received 500 million US dollars, 650 million Australian dollars from 10 investment advisory firms after the accidental transfer. The court ruled the lenders were justified in believing the payment was intentional. Citibank itself did not realize the magnitude of its mistake until nearly a day later. To believe that Citibank, one of the most sophisticated financial institutions in the world, had made a mistake that had never happened before, to the tune of nearly one US dollar, one Australian dollar. 29 billion, would have been borderline irrational, the court document said. The judge's ruling used internal chats between HPS employees as further proof the creditors had no idea the wiring was a mistake until after Citibank sent notices. In the chat, which was dated a day after the mistaken wiring, HPS employees joked about the error. 
Free 5, I feel really bad for the person that fat fingered the $900 million erroneous payment. Not a great career move. Trobino with 12, certainly looks like they'll be looking for new people for their ops group Free 5, how was work today honey? It was okay, except I accidentally sent $900 million out to people who weren't supposed to have it Free 5, downside of work from home. Maybe the dog hit the keyboard with op. And finally, thank you all for watching the video. Please like and comment your opinion so we can discuss together. Don't forget to subscribe, press the bell to follow and update many other interesting news. See you in the next videos. Goodbye.